First kata we're going to work is Pinan Sandan, Pinan 3, the third of the Pinan katas, also composed by Master Itosu about 100 years ago. We're going to start out like we've started the rest of the katas up to now, feet together, bow, okay, ready stance. We're going to turn this way to, to my left, execute a left middle block, pulling my right hand right tight to my hip. Step my right foot up, execute double block, right uh, middle block, left down block, and follow that with the reverse. Left middle block, right down block. Be sure on these that you keep your arms out at the correct angle. One of the frequent faults we see on this is people get this really cramped up. So you want to be sure that you've got that right there. I'm going to look over my right shoulder. I'm going to turn. Same thing reverse, just like most of the peanuts. Turn this way. Right middle block. Pull them, pull them back. Step up. Left double block, right double block. Looking to the front, stepping into a left front stance, executing a, a uh, augmented block, left augmented block. Now I'm going to step forward with my right foot into a right front stance, execute a right nukite, spear hand, folding my hand back like this. Now here's a big step coming. You probably noticed when we ran the, the video. To make the footwork, I'm going to do the footwork only from right here. I'm going to turn my foot in this way, shift my weight to this leg. I've got to reach way around with this foot and turn so that I'm in this angle. I'm at this 45 degree angle right here facing that way. The common mistake on that move is people, people will get around to about here and turn maybe to here, but they turn, but they haven't gotten the angle. You've really got to do that. So let's do that footwork one more time. From here, I'm finished. I'm, here's my stance. Just finished my nukite. I'm going to pivot that foot in there. Bring this foot around, all the way. Presto. Proper angle. Left down block right there. I'm in a horse stance, facing about 1:30 on the clock. Now I'm going to step forward, and I'm going to cut my steps here because I'm getting real close to the camera. But these are three forward steps. I'm going to step, punch. Step, punch, step, punch, right there. Our next move is we move with our right foot and step. Now sometimes another frequent area of confusion when people learn this kata is they step with their back foot. On this foot, I'm going to step with my right foot right up to here. Feet are together. Feet are together. Hands are on my hips. I'm going to step out with my right foot into a right horse stance. I'm going to dip my shoulder, come back, back knuckle strike. Step, again, dip my shoulder, back knuckle strike. I'm going to move back a little bit. Ordinarily, I would keep going. Three. Step, dip, back knuckle strike. From here, I'm going to move my left foot and step that way into a left lunge punch, front stance with a lunge punch. I step, punch. Now my right foot comes up even with it, about shoulder width stance. I'm going to move my back leg around to here, pivot, punching over my right shoulder. Right foot comes up, kicks inside. Left hand comes over the top, over the shoulder here. I'm in a, in a, in a horse stance and Back to a ready stance. Bow. There it is. There's the breakdown for Pinan Sandan.